commander of troops is now preparing to move the officers and colors forward for presentation to the official party. Harry Mercado will join the command and position themselves for the change of command. The very soul of a military unit is symbolized in the colors under which it fights. For they record the glories of the past, stand guardian over its present destiny, and ensure inspiration for its future. From the earliest times, warriors have used a banner or other symbols to identify units and to serve as a rallying point for their troops. At the beginning of the 17th century, armies throughout the world were adopting a regimental system. Regiments were assigned a specific color and number for ease of identification. The position of the regiment on the battlefield and the location of its command were revealed by the location of its banner. In battle, the color party marched at the front of the formation and became prime targets. As victories in those days were expressed in terms of the number of enemy colors captured, the color party bore the brunt of the battle and often suffered heavy casualties. If the commander fell, someone would rally to the colors and assume the position of unit leadership. Today, Command Sergeant Major Harry Mercado will present the colors symbolizing the duty and responsibilities of command to the outgoing commander, Lieutenant Colonel Harry Freeberg. Lieutenant Colonel Freeberg relinquished the colors and his command to Colonel Chase, the commander, 1st Signal Brigade. Colonel Chase will then pass the colors and the command to new commander of the 36th Signal Battalion, Lieutenant Colonel Rosenstein. By authority of paragraph 3-1 Alpha, AR 600-20, the undersigned assumes command of the 36th Signal Battalion, 2 June 2009. Signed, Mark E. Rosenstein, Lieutenant Colonel, Signal Corps, Commanding. <laughs> 